What's up guys, that car dude back with another video and today is a 100 sub video Thank you guys for 100 subs. So as you know every 100 subs Like usually for a big milestone People do something special. So I thought What's more special than this? A long time ago I put something on my channel and it was, what's it called? It was my gaming wheel review and it was an old Microsoft 360 gaming wheel for when I had my 360 well, didn't have my one. So I had that. So then I moved on to a new gaming wheel that I never showed you guys because it was in quite a bit of the videos. Let me get it here. It was in quite a bit of the videos of me drifting, but it broke. I never did, like, one. it lasted for about a month or two. And then it started to kind of break down. Then slowly over time, it would only, it had, like, wiring problems. So the wheel would be like this in real life, but it would be like this in game, like, fully turned around. So it broke, so I took it apart, If you, so I can keep the wheel, I took it apart. But if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, this is what I am talking about. It is an $80 Ferrari wheel that you can buy from Thrustmaster. I've seen a lot of bad stuff about it, so I did not do that. And I decided, why not go big or go home? Number one, I didn't want to buy a cheap one again. What's the point of buying a cheap one if it breaks again? So. I bought this, a Thrustmaster TMX, and this baby is insane. Let me just sit down. This thing is amazing. It comes with regular pedals, so that is kind of like a bummer, but who knows? Maybe I can get, maybe I can get the big like shifter and uh, pedals with clutch, but so let's turn up the TV. That's what happens when you look at a camera. But yeah, guys, I like it too. Where it's a force feedback car, so every time I hit a bump or something, it like kind of messes with the steering. So it's pretty cool. And uh, didn't mean to do that, but I've had it for maybe an hour or two now. I don't really know, but. I've been loving this. It kind of is a big leap to go from a, a gaming wheel that turns this much to this much. Ah. Disgusting! I don't know, but if you guys can't tell, I'm double jointed. Ow. So that was a fail to that much. So let's see. That's basically one and a half times. But yeah, guys, if you didn't know, I'm double jointed. Can do this with my finger. Sorry to freak you guys out. But yeah, this thing is awesome. I kind of have to get used to it because A, like it's on the fry wheel, it's B, A. So I have to get used to reaching over to this and all that, but I'll get used to it. I'm pretty sure I said it, and I'll say it in the title, but it's the Thrustmaster TMX Force Feedback Wheel. It looks amazing. 
Someone just hit me. Someone just hit and ran. Oh, well. but yeah, this wheel is really cool, and I'll try some drifting right now. Ah. Uh, really, what can you do? But yeah, after a little bit of testing out, I figured out I'm not very good at the GTR. I'm good at the Supra, or mainly good at the Supra. So I switched over to the Supra. So I'm gonna keep going. The funny thing to me though is I'm better with the Supra going uphill. I'm terrible going downhill with this. Uphill seems to be my thing. Somehow have twenty three thousand points though. Have you guys? Heard? The cockpit is amazing. I've never. I've like just realized that. I like to do it in third gear. Third gear feels good personally it's for me. See you guys, I don't know why, but I do, I do a better run uphill. Than